Hello everyone, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever part of the world you're coming from. Welcome, my name is Olive and welcome to my page and I want to talk to you today about Facebook Live challenges and I'm just finishing mine and what I've learned and why you should maybe do one uh, the next time they come up. So if you're joining me live, please say hello, tell me where you're coming from. And if you're on the replay, then let me know that it's a replay and I would be happy to shout out to you afterwards. And so I have been on a 14 day live challenge and this is the, the last day. This is not my first time at the rodeo. This is my third uh, live challenge uh, that I've been on. I was on a 21 day, a 30 day, and now a 14 day. So obviously I am enjoying them because this is my third one. And they definitely get easier as you progress. They are definitely a learning curve, but I have grown so much. When I first started out in January, February last time, I was a lot more nervous. I am more comfortable now. There's still a few jitters and that kind of thing, but it definitely gets easier every time you do it. Uh, just practice, practice, practice. And the thing about the challenge is it makes you give priority to doing a live every day because in between the live challenges, I have had intentions to go live and I have gone live, but not as often as I wanted. So the challenges definitely do commit you to doing that every day. They make it a priority. So I just you think, okay, I am committed to this. I am just going to do it no matter what. And there were definitely days when I did not feel like doing it. Ups and downs, good days, bad days, but you just have to get in there and do it anyway. That's just the way it goes, especially if you want to grow your business because you don't have a boss, so you are your boss. You have to have the willpower and the determination to just, just do it. Five, four, three, two, one. Just push that button and just go with it. Don't overthink it. Just do it. And another wonderful thing about uh, these lives is the community. I have gained so many friends from previous uh, communities and that has been strengthened every time we get to know each other and I have learned, <clears throat> I have uh, gained new uh, friends from this uh, challenge. New people come on all the time and so of course you tend to uh, see the same people with the Facebook algorithm. They put more, more of the same people in front of you as you comment on it so you get to know each other listening to people's stories and their challenges and watching them grow. It's just it's so wonderful. And then someday actually meeting up in person is so keen. <clears throat> and one of the tips that uh, I found is really helpful is as you go about your daily routine or your life and you find something that might be useful for a live, then you take note of it or you bookmark it or uh, take notes right away. And then I keep everything in a folder so that then when I want to go live, I have a folder full of information and I can see, okay, well, what's um, pertinent for today? What do I want to talk about today? What uh, is uh, coming up for me? So that's really good. And also watching the other people, going back to the community. Um, watching how others do things gives me inspiration for how I might improve and it also gives me permission to be more of myself and that's really key uh, it's not just talking I tend to talk really really fast and just you know try and get my information out and I am working on being more comfortable uh, just to speak more naturally and you know like I'm speaking to someone in particular uh, so that's really key for me and I want to give a big shout out to Helen Martin who has hosted um, or has mentored us uh, through this challenge she is just amazing she does all this for free gives her time her energy her knowledge and encouragement and has brought all these people together and thank you so much Helen you have been such a big influence in my life and, and so many others. So thank you, Helen. 
Ah, and so when this is done afterwards, I am definitely going to carry on. I'm going to uh, carry on collecting my ideas and I am committing to doing uh, three lives per week, um, probably Monday, Wednesday and Friday, maybe Tuesday, Wednesday and Friday, because Monday seem to be full of all kinds of other things that uh, so it gets a little bit hectic. But that is my commitment uh, to go three days a week uh, during the week. And so that will be a good balance of life and business. And also I need to post more, uh, do uh, more informational type of posts. So I want to add that to my um, array of um, value that I, I post to my page. And I have also the, the other thing that I learned is all about watch parties. And they're really, really cool. And so I want to start incorporating watch parties, maybe, you know, with a group of people sharing something that, um, you know, is pertinent to a small group of people. And then we can watch together and type it. So I think that's a really cool idea. Ah, so I think that's about all. I would definitely recommend a live challenge to anybody who is wants to build their business online and is fearful about doing lives and just wants to know a lot more about it. Um, there's tips and tricks and a little bit of technology in there, you know, that uh, is easily mastered when you have someone helping you and showing you just how to do things. So... That's all I have to say for today. And I just thank you again, everyone who has supported me and watched my uh, lives. I really, really appreciate your watching, your comments, your support. And I look forward to uh, still listening to everybody else's and to doing more lives. So, all right, have a wonderful day, whatever part of the day it is for you. And thank you everyone uh, for your comments. All right, we'll see you again very soon. Bye for now.